How's it going, everybody? C Rad TV back here in our video. So, of course, it's time for another NASCAR diecast unboxing. I think you can tell just by this t shirt which one it is. This is the Kyle Larson Kansas Race Win diecast. So, yeah, this they just ship it now like this instead of actually having the box. So, it takes away half to join these unboxings. But, so let's open it up and let's take a look at it. So, here we go. There, throw that box away. And unwrap it. There's your side. See, here's right here the Kyle Arson Kansas Race Win Diecast, right here in the box. But now, let's go ahead and let's take it out of the box and open her up. So, here we go. Also, got a bunch of stuff here like. Like this and this we don't need, but we do get the race winner sticker right here. Another one to the collection. And we got the Kyle Larson hero card right here. And everything about the race on the back right here. So they had a Kyle Larson hero card, but now here is the race win die cast. And voila. Yeah, of course, just a nice looking car here. You got a little bit of some paint scruffs here from when Larson made contact with the wall. Same deal on the other side here, but for the most part, it's still pretty clean for the most part. Like, well, still a clean car for the most part here. So, yeah, not a bad car here. Of course, on the side, it says Greg Big Sean Fornelli. And of course, then we got the yellow banner here and the spoiler. So yeah, still a nice looking car here for sure. And the VIN number is 424. And they made 948 of these. So there's quite a few of these. So yeah, still a nice looking car for sure. And of course, some cars and he got this win on the 17 year anniversary of the HMS plane crash that took the lives of many people, including both of Rick Hendrick's twin daughters. Well, I mean, Rick's brother, Jeff, and both the wind daughters, and of course, Rick's son, Ricky, and of course, some um, lead HMS engineer, Randy Dunn, and of course, HMS GM at the time, Jeff Turner. And there's actually a little bit of confetti right there, just a few small pieces, but not a whole lot. Not that much confetti. No, oh, maybe not a whole lot. But still a nice looking clean die cast for the most part. And of course, I mean, it was only fitting that Kansas that Kyle Larson ran that race in this paint scheme. Especially at the track that Ricky Henrik got his one and only truck series win 20 years ago. So yeah. See, so, yeah, of course. And of course, they will forever, everyone in HMS that we lost that day will forever be in our hearts. But yeah, still, nice looking car for the most part. So yeah, another Kyle Larson die cast to the collection. So there's three dial Kyle Larson die cast that are left for 2021. And those being the Charlotte Roval, the Texas one, and Phoenix for the championship. We also got the Bowman uh, Martinsville die cast still left. But yeah, the Kansas one is another one to the collection. But yeah, anyway, that'll wrap it up here. And that's all I got to say. Well, Bam was a great day, and I'll see you whenever I make next. Peace, NASCAR heavyweight champ, out.